Breaking news, true crimeers, the Zodiac Killer has allegedly been identified. A group of about 40 previous investigative specialists known as the Case Breakers, and these are people who are detectives, journalists, military intelligence officers. The Zodiac Killer murdered at least five different people between 1968 and 1969 and is one of America's most prolific unidentified serial killers. They have identified the Zodiac Killer as a man by the name of Gary Francis Post or Post Day. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. The case breakers used the letters that the Zodiac Killer had sent to the media, along with several, like, ciphers and, and coded messages, that apparently, if you know his full name, that actually helps break the coded messages. So in one of the letters, what they did was they removed all of the letters that made up his name from the note, and then that revealed an actual, like, worded message, like a coherent message you can read. They also used an old photo of him linked up with the very famous uh, composite drawing of the Zodiac Killer. The scars that were always identified across the Zodiac Killer's forehead matches the exact same scars that were across Gary Post's forehead. Now, Gary Post actually died. He died in 2018. Now, in terms of how they actually linked Gary Post to the Zodiac Killer, I'm not sure about. I don't think they have revealed that particular information. But they also believe that they have linked another murder that was not associated with the Zodiac Killer to him now. But this murder happened hundreds of miles away. Keep in mind, this is not conclusive yet. I'm not sure if they have any DNA evidence that they can link to Gary from the Zodiac Killer. But the case breakers have allegedly been investigating him for years. They have access to one of his dark rooms, which is where they revealed photos of him that showed the scars across his forehead. But I just don't know how they initially made that connection to this man. Because I don't believe he was ever listed as a suspect. But once they reveal more information, I will let you guys know as well. It's pretty cool, actually. I never thought that this case would be solved, so I really hope that this is legit.